All right, here we go. Let's see what it is. Everyone that can fight mm -hmm. already is, and we're still losing. We're only going to win this one together. Sigil up. Mm -hmm. yep. I call this it. I call it doom magic. <laughs> That's what I call it. A single player first person magic shooter yeah. where you unleash an arsenal of magic spells in fast paced. This gives me those doom vibes. FPS conventions. In the world of Asia, I think it has assassinations too. powers everything from industry and everyday life to the military might of its five kingdoms. Five. But this world is crumbling apart. For thousands of years, these kingdoms have killed each other over the control hmm. of magic. They call it the Ever War. It's almost like some Godfall stuff. You play as Jack, <laughs> yeah, a triarch, an extremely rare type of spellcaster. Capable of wielding all three colors of magic mm. with deadly precision. I'm guessing that's like the rare thing. Together with Lucium's elite battle mages, an order of magni called the Immortals, Jack must race to stop Rasharn's yeah. tyrant Sandrak and prevent Avium from falling into oblivion. <laughs> Your weapon, called a sigil, will help you focus the magic within you. Yeah, it looks nice. Sigils are devices that help Magni channel their innate power to make it more effective and deadly in combat. I swear, this game like is gonna kill your FPS. <laughs> That's what I feel like. Like you're not playing on console and your PC not up to par. This day is gonna kill your goddamn FPS. Red sigils empower a Magnus's close quarters combat capabilities. Blue sigils focus magic into powerful bolts for long range engagements. Green sigils cast rapid fire homing projectiles that enable mobile combat maneuvers. Fury spells are heavy, more powerful spells that drain your mana bar. And you'll need to find and crush mana crystals to replenish it. Mm. Augment spells allow you to manipulate and navigate the world around you. Okay. These can be used to scale precarious chasms, move large objects out of the way, float. or access hidden locations. They also assist in solving puzzles. Yep. Control spells tell you, it's like Doom, man. by allowing Jack to pull enemies toward him, slow enemies, or stun enemies. Almost like Mortar in too. Mortals of Avium, you know? your most powerful attack in that, is also, called the Melee. Too. Anybody else? It charges up over time and is released as a destructive beam of red, blue, and green magic to disintegrate anything in your way. Hmm. Although all colors of magic will damage most enemies, matching your magic attack <laughs> with the enemy's magic color will more efficiently shred their armor and reduce their defenses. Like magic spell? Mastering your magic means customizing spell. your spell casting to suit how you want to play. Ooh. Discover 25 different spells and unlock over oh. 80 talents. Loot hundreds of handcrafted items. Craft, dismantle, and upgrade your clutch gear in the forge. What? Equip sigils, totems, rings, uh. and bracers to boost your spells, abilities, yeah, and stats like, well, in combat. It's like you got like a, I want to say like, well, not like, three oh, hubs no, no, to no, explore vibrant like landscapes. Delve into unknown depths and embark on some of the most dangerous and covert missions as one of Lucian's elite immortals. <laughs> Jack and I the immortals look like are running out of time. Hood almost. <laughs> In the middle of Avium is the wound. A formless void, ever growing, ever dividing the realm. And out. On the other side of the front lines is the seemingly unstoppable oh, Sandrak, yeah. amassing more power with each passing day. Mm. This is Immortals of Avium. Avium? Summon your power. Stop the Ever War. Hmm. Save the realms. Yeah. Yeah, this comes all like. Right? Almost. Yeah, it's like the, uh, the only other game that's coming out in August. Right? There's literally like no games coming out in August. Literally. Also, I don't count like the Maddens or. The other little random game before anything like that. I think that's the only one. Maybe under the under the waves, maybe? That's about it. Oh. I think nothing else comes out. Yeah. 
This is like the only other game that's in order of magnet call making any noise or looking Jack like it's gonna be crazy Hearing nice. Spells allow you to manipulate and navigate mm -hmm. the world around you. These can be used to scale precarious chasms, move large objects out of the way. I just want to see how it runs, <laughs> personally. They also assist in it runs good. Be a good it'd be a good game. It runs like shit. To pull Looking at another uh, Stone Wars type game, you know. Wait a couple of weeks till they get till they fix itself. <laughs> in Immortals of Avium, your most but, uh, powerful yeah. attack is called Immolate. It's looking uh, pretty nice overall. So yeah, we'll check it out. We'll check it out. Indeed. Indeed, indeed. Let me know what you think, chat. Legendary out.